Hello friends, today we will see how to interface force sensor in Arduino. For that purpose, log in to your Tinkercad account. In that, click on designs. Then you will see your existing designs. Click on new circuits. One blank circuit design will get open after this. So what we need to do is we need Arduino for sensor and LED. So here we are going to use if the force is applied on the sensor, then we are going to see how much force is applied and we will check if this force is applied, then LED will turn on. So search for Arduino Uno. Arduino Uno. We will rotate this for our simplicity purpose. Then we will have LED. We will have before that go for all components. Then search for force sensor. So this is force sensor. Now we will do the connectivity of LED, Arduino and force sensor. So this LED will be connected for pin number 13. So the connection will be like this. It is connected to pin number 13. Then this is connected to ground like this these are the connections of leds now we will connect force sensor for the connection purpose we are going to connect this force sensor at a0 because it is an analog sensor so this is 5 volt pin so we will connect this part to 5 volt power supply here right then we will connect this end to a0 pin this is a0 so here it will be connected now we have to connect ground also for that purpose, we are going to use register over here for connection to the ground. So rotate this. Okay. Now the ground is connected like this. And it is connected like this. Okay, so these are the connections. LED is connected to pin number 13 and force sensor is connected to A0 like this. If you understand the connection, now we will proceed further for coding part. So click on code here, click on text continue already code is available so we will remove that code we have code with us so simply use this code now before explaining this code let me show you the output how this code will work and how these connections will work so for that purpose once we have written the code click on start simulation so it is started click on serial monitor we can see four sensor reading is there now what we need to do is simply click on the sensor one bar will appear here as soon as you move this bar in upward direction that means you are going to apply the force on the force sensor 
in that case this value will going to change or you can see the value in the serial monitor also when this value will be non zero led will be turn on and the value will change here see this okay the value is 0.27 now so led is turn on and we can see this force applied is something non zero value will be appear here unless and until you will apply the force led will turn on and the value will get change when you will remove your force it will be zero this value will be zero and led will get turn off this is how the connection will be this will helps us in applying or using the force sensor now we will see the coding part here we have defined two variables first one will be for your force sensor and second one will be for led so hash define force sensor it will be connected to a0 that's why one variable is used force sensor a0 second variable is led which will be connected on pin number 13 so it is defined at 13 value then word setup serial begin 9600 standard value pin mode force sensor is set for taking the input and led is set for giving the output that's why pin mode led is output and pin mode force sensor is input this is the setup part of your connections now we will go for loop function in loop function as we know that force sensor is analog sensor for that purpose we are going to use one variable let's say its name is integer analog reading is equals to as this is your analog sensor we are going to use the built in function analog read to read the values from analog sensor so analog read in bracket force sensor that means we are going to read the input value with the help of this force sensor variable by analog read function and that value is stored in this integer variable now we will display that part that variable value on the screen with the help of this serial print after that we will check now our next task is we need to interface or we need to execute the part of your led for that purpose we are going to use if loop if analog read is equals to 0 that means force is not applied in that case led will be low that means led will be turn off and if the value it changes from 0 to non zero value it will jump to else part and it will display or it will turn on the led with the help of this digital write led comma high this is how the led will be monitor for your force sensor with the help of your arduino programming thank you